Okay, we left off. We had left off on. Uh, we finished Halach uh, Gimel, with the Mechaber. It said if a person urinates, and he did not say Asher Yotzer, and he urinates a second time, he has to say Asher Yotzer twice. Twice. That's the Mechaber. So if you have to say Asher Yotzer twice, there's no question. If you didn't say Asher Yotzer, and you urinated a second time, and you had an urge to urinate a second, you definitely say Asher Yotzer. Here he's saying if you urinated twice, you have to say Asher Yotzer each of the times that you'd urinated. Right? What, what period of time are we talking no, about? No, person urinates uh, 9 o'clock and urinates at 11. He forgot to say a shiyotze for an, at 9 o'clock. So after the second urination, the mechaber says you, you say a twice. Yeah, really? No, that's the mechaber. That's the mechaber. We don't rule. So he cited on the, the bottom. The Shari Chuba brings others that say that even a person has an urge to urinate again, although you had urinated before, you don't say a shiyotze any longer. Right? And that's, that's the way we, we conduct ourselves. Therefore, you should say Asher Yotzer after your name because you never know what's going to be. You may have an urge again, and the moment you have the urge, you've lost the ability to say the original Asher Yotzer. No, no, no. 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 Asher Yotzer is thanking God that He gives you the function to be able to relieve yourself. Wait a second. Birchas HaMosin is you're thanking God that you were sated. So if 72 minutes passes after you've eaten, you don't feel that, you don't have that satiation any longer. You've lost it. That's the reason why. Therefore, you don't bench twice. Because you have to have that sense of feeling sated. This has nothing with feeling relieved. Because God gave me a function, and because of that function, I'm able to live. So I, have to, I, I owe God twice. I have to thank God twice. That's the Mechaber. Right. Therefore, you say a shayot so twice. Is there another example of a birchus anenin where you do that? It's not a birchus anenin. This birchus hodo, giving thanks to God. That anenin is because I benefited. This is not birchus anenin. This is anenin is before, always before you eat. You say a bracha. Okay. That's birchus anenin. Okay. The bracha afterwards is not birchus anenin. You say birchus hamozon is not anenin. It's that? giving th- thanks, okay. giving okay. thanks to God. Right. That so what's that the difference then? No, that's what I just said. Because okay. there. You're thanking God that you're sated. But, but that's also essential for living. No, 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 no. But that's not what we say. Birchas <laughs> You thank God that you that you are sated. Here, Asher Yotzei, the Mechaber had a whole lengthy uh, explanation what the, what the text reads. We cannot live or survive unless we have our function. You know, the oracles, the open, the, the closed, and the ones that are closed open, we, we wouldn't be able to live. So we're thanking God that we have that function. And we're able to use that function, therefore we're alive. So you, a person saves your life twice. You thank him once or you thank him twice? You thank him twice. So therefore, the Chabbat says, you say, Asher Yotzer twice. We always say, Yashir Yotzer, after we relieve ourselves. Well, urinate. But there are other openings. Say, Asher Yotzer. No, but we said earlier, if you... If you suppress a sneeze, you're not going to die. If you have an obstruction in your intestines where you don't relieve yourself, there's toxicity. You die from the, from, the, from the poison in the body. That, that the body is able to expel the impurities, that's why you're alive. If it wouldn't, you would die. Sneezing or not sneezing is what doesn't determine whether you live or die. So, say a blockage in an artery. Yeah, but it's not usual. No, I understand that. But So, what is, when, what do you say? If a person has open heart surgery and they clear the blockage, right. so God said, you say, you say Shechianu. <laughs> Thank God that you're alive, because that that's a one-time deal. Here it's a continuous process. Ashiyot says a continuous process that it doesn't accumulate to allow to bring you to a state of danger. That's not. An, it's a cover. What do I put a blindfold on you? And, and and you can only, and so, and not, not, not a ray of light could penetrate the blindfold. I take it off. You say, Asher Yotzar. Okay. You're not, no, that's not blind. It's covered. It's a covering. Yes, yes. Baruch Achron is Birch Soda. You're giving thanks to God. According to the Mechaber, let's suppose that a person does his bodily function to forget to say the Baruch He does it again a little bit later. Why can't he have one bracha, uh, you know, the bracha, one bracha, 
Sri Rata and have in mind to cover both. Why wouldn't the Mahabharata say that's a preferable way to do it? Okay. I want everybody to hear David's question. Okay. Person that was supposed to dump married forgets inadvertently. Shachris. Come Shachris, he realizes he didn't dump married. How many Shachris does he have to dump him? Twice. Why? He's saying the same text. Let him have mind when he says Shachris. This should be Shachris and Tamayr. Well, it's not exactly parallel. Okay, it wasn't a parallel. Because um, they are different. The, the text may be the same, but they are different. Uh, mincha, okay, <coughs> Shachris and Mincha. Identical. The obligation of Shachris and Mincha are identical. Yes. Well, no. The obligation is identical. Identical. Night, you could say it's, it's Rishus, whatever it may be, there, there are, there's a slight variation. But Shachris and Mincha. It's the identical level of obligation, no less obligation. So, why not? so what's the answer? I, I'll, I'll give you the answer, and it's, it, that's why it's I think it's exact. Because initially you were supposed to dump married. You had an obligation. <coughs> you understand? It's not a person that has two, th uh, two things come out simultaneously, and you do one act, and it satisfies both. Here, they, they came about in increments. I had an obligation. You have an obligation to give thanks. Now you have another obligation. So he says, you know something? I'll give one thank you. It will cover both of my obligations. The obli it's a double obligation here. Therefore, one can't cover. You have an obligation to daven shachris. You forgot. Now mitra comes. So you have a second obligation. So you say, well, it's the same text. I'll, I'll just say one shachris. I'll mind both. But you have a double obligation you have to cover. You have to address a double obligation. You have a double obligation to say thank you to God, to acknowledge that, that you were, had this ability. Therefore, having in mind is not sufficient. <coughs> we do say that, though, with the eating, the proper after the eating, after the or uh, for rain or short. Well, it's okay. But that's the way it's, no, but that's the way it was legislated. Whatever you eat and you finish, <coughs> because it all goes under the umbrella of burying the fosho, so ala michio, whatever it may be, it, it's all encompassing. There, there was never an obligation to say more than one brocha No, no, I'm giving you exactly the same. Give me I drank example. a glass, I drank a cup of coffee. Okay. And I forgot to say the rain of Russia. <coughs> Fifteen minutes later, I decided to have another cup of coffee. I make sure I call. No. And afterwards, I okay, remember let's talk. I forgot the first time. Let's, let's talk again. Okay. <coughs> Firstly, <coughs> do you say a second shako? No, I, I forgot. I did. No, 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 no. When you drink a cup of coffee. Well, if I didn't have in mind to, to cover Even if the halach is, even if you don't have a mind, what you want to have, unless you had a mind, I definitely will not have more than one cup. Well, that's what he had in mind. Okay, not more than one cup. And then I'm done. Okay. So now, now he and he should have said a bracha achron. He should have said, and he forgot, and he has a... But the time, doesn't he have in mind to say, I'm saying it now for this one, but I'm also covering my first one? I thought that's the way we do that. Okay. You don't make two. Wait, 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 wait. That's a better question. This question here is now is a better question. It, it, that seems to be a question. It, you, you drink one, uh, let's, let's make, you drink a glass of water. A cup of coffee is not so simple. You say, burn the potions. Because it depends how you drink it. Okay? You drink a gl glass of water. You had an obligation to say, burn the potions, and you forgot. Five, in, and you had a mind, one glass, not more than another. He has a, he has a urination problem, so he's careful how much his water intake. Okay, so he has in mind one glass, not more than one glass. Then he's thirsty five minutes later, he has another glass. He says another shako. He only says one burn the fosha, some both. Another question. So you see one, even though initially, after the first thing, I don't know, because they burn the foshos, right? So that, that would be a parallel to this, right? right? Okay. Let, let's, let's make a differentiation. Okay, there is a difference, okay? Also Wait a second. I, w I just want to make the difference. There is a difference, and the difference is a very clear, distinct difference. David, this is important. Okay? I'm teaching how to be a little bit of a lambdan. Okay? So, here, what's the, what brought about the obligation if he drank the first glass of water? Because he decided not to have another glass. You understand? It's not because when you finish one glass, you have an obligation to say, burn the fushers. Because he decided... He wants one glass, not another glass. Here, every bodily function or every act of urination obligates you to, to, to acknowledge God for, for that ability. It has nothing to do with what your, what your mindset is. See, here, it's only, let's say he wouldn't have had it. He would have had a mind to continuously drink. That he wouldn't have had an obligation. So he's the one who determines the obligation. 
with the bodily function or the urination, it's, he doesn't determine anything. The act itself is what brings about the obligation. Therefore, it's, it, it's, it's similar to Shimon Esrei. He had an obligation to Avrish Achris, to Mincha, two separate obligations. Each one's distinct in its own right. Therefore, even though you see the, the text is identical, but since it's a double obligation, you have to address each obligation. Therefore, you have to say two Shimon Esrei's. Say you had a perforation for colonoscopy. So you know David, you, you hear the difference? You yeah, go ahead. This is not his field, okay. Okay. So, so you have a preparation. So you know, for the next six hours, you're going to be spending a lot of time doing the bodily functions. Okay. Check it out. Can you can, can you say to yourself, I'm just going to say one Asher Yasser? No, Dan. No, wait, 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 wait. Wait. Let's let's talk. Let's say a person is doing his bodily function. No, come out. No, 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 no insurance coverage. Of you, right. Person ha- is doing his bodily mm-hmm. function, and he gets a call. He interrupts it. And then, then he knows he's going back. Does he say a or after the first after the int- first interruption? Yes or no? No. He hasn't finished do- doing his bodily functions. So he never had an obligation. The case was being he urinates, he's fully satisfied. He has no urge any longer. So because now you finish urinating, you have an obligation to say a shayotzer. Now you have an, another urge, and you urinate a second time. So when you finish the first, the obligation came... Here, you're in the middle of doing your function. The obligation never came about. When you drink that, that, that solution for the colonoscopy, it's an ongoing. You're in the middle. You haven't fully cleansed yourself. Therefore, the obligation only comes at the end, when you're fully cleaned out, cleansed. Even though there could be half an hour. Doesn't make a difference how long it takes. Doesn't make a difference how long it takes. Okay, see that? Doctor Rabbi, Rabbi Doctor, okay. <laughs> same thing, same thing.